<laughs> don't ask any questions, guys. Just don't ask, okay? I'll, I'll just let you know, though, what's going on here. So, if you're slightly confused at the new skin, welcome back, by the way, to another episode of Truly Bedrock. So, um, what, a little over a week ago, we did the Iron Dealings, um, like the Iron Challenge with Zloy, and unfortunately, we lost by, like, a couple stacks. Oh, it was horrible. And, you know... I'm a good sport, so basically the whole deal, the whole deal and the whole um, bet was to basically whoever won got to pick a derpy skin for the for the person that lost, for the loser, and that that unfortunately <laughs> was me. And um, yeah, this is what Zloy, but this is what Zloy chose. Yeah, I don't even know what I am honestly. Like, I don't even have like any room for. Let me just let me find a chest. Let me find an empty chest here and drop some stuff off. I don't know why I have all this armor, but I do. Um, let's just kind of throw that in there. Okay. So, <clears throat> yes. Let's just take a look at my skin. Here I am. And apparently my name is P-Man, I think. <laughs> That's what Zloy said. I don't even know what kind of shoes I have on. But I'm honestly... Um, I'm honestly kind of scary, honestly. I'm kind of scared. And uh, and I think this is going to be the last time we look at this face today. Maybe, possibly, until the end of the episode. <laughs> oh, okay. I'm done. I'm done looking at that skin. It's hideous. Let's put all of our stuff back on. So, anyways. Um, yeah, I hope everybody's doing fantastic. I'm doing amazing, as always. And, of course, it is... Uh, thank you, Drone. Thank you so much. Okay. <clears throat> so, anyways. Um, so, earlier today, I got on and... Let me just give you a little example of how great we are doing in the shopping district. We managed to make over a stack of diamonds. Well, this is not a stack of diamonds, but um, we made over a stack of diamonds just from selling our wither kits. So, yes, we sold both of them. And we also sold... Actually, let's head on over there because I forgot what else I ran out of. Um, so, I think we're done with the iron business. We're, we're done with the whole scheme of things drone's such a nice guy also by the way yeah i can't you guys are probably wondering who's that if you don't already know so we have three new members that we have added recently to tb and it is so exciting we have the jesse b um a lot of you guys may know her from um the truly bedrock rundown which unfortunately is no longer uh around but um she was one of the uh creators of that show which was awesome uh here we go and then we have killer drone um awesome uh, actually he's coming over from java to kind of take a swing and see how he really truly likes uh no pun intended <laughs> how he really truly likes bedrock honestly i think i think he's gonna have a good time i know he's a redstone guy so that part is going to be kind of difficult to kind of adjust to but honestly i think of silent um, can do it and enjoy himself because silence awesome. Um, I think Killer can have a great time as well. Uh, and then of course, last but not least, we have um, Echo Soldier. So I know a lot of you guys may be familiar with him. Um, so I played with him a few times. Actually, we've been in a couple of SMPs together. Um, those will remain unnamed. <laughs> but uh, but yeah, we sold all the wither kits. Um, haven't sold anything here or here. Um, we sold all of our iron. And we sold all of our redstone blocks, which I did replace. Um, I put more redstone in there. And then we have the nether brick. Um, oh, yeah. And then I decided to go ahead and sell horse armor because why not? Two diamonds a piece. I feel that's cool. He went down on his prices. So two diamonds or six pebbles. A stack. <gasps> I will so take two stacks. Oh, awesome. I'm so happy. Oh, it looks good in here, too. I love, I love the look of it all. It looks great. It looks so good. I love this is definitely down my alley right here. I love making shelves this way. Oh my god, this is awesome. I'm so happy. I'll be here long time. <laughs> oh, he's even selling golden apples for three diamonds. Um, I think oh, gold blocks for 25 diamonds each. Jeez. <laughs> um, well, I don't really have a lot of use for gold blocks, but I'll definitely be a returning customer there. Um, oh, by the way, I did buy one of these. I forgot to say that too. <laughs> I bought one of these. Look at this. Let me just show you. So this is the uh, this is issue three for the Truly Bedrock Herald. Uh, invest in Pebble. <laughs> um, science triumphs. Local redstoner has created life. Meh, life. That's obviously kill the drone. And then of course I think the next one would be Jesse B. Uh, We're not alone. Lady we found in the forest claims that she's the original player of the realm. So apparently Jesse's been stuck in the realm and we just didn't even know. She's been stuck in a woodland mansion apparently. Um, let me see here. Alien life born 
Alien life form. Nope. Just Echo Soldier. <laughs> My roof is ruined. Thanks, Echo. Oh, yeah. Did you guys watch that episode? If you didn't, I highly recommend you go and check it out. Oh, my arm keeps throwing me off. I keep forgetting I have this weird skin on. Um, so let's see, let's see. Oh, what's going on over here? What is this? The end is near. Beware the moon. Where? Where's the moon? <laughs> the moon is pretty freaky. It is pretty scary. Oh, no. Tis Tom has decided not to do pledge anymore. That's a sad, sad thing. Well, at least we got a beacon out of it. We got a beacon out of it. Oh, this is cool. What does this say? Oh, there's new shops. Is that a shulker? Oh, shulker shop. Uh, shul, shul, that's a tongue twister. Shulker shop. <laughs> Apparently there's one over here. Let's check that out. I feel like I haven't been here in forever, which I really haven't. So we're just going to take a, a quick tour. I have to just kind of check everything out. Ooh, sell. Oh, what's this? Please help. Can't afford student loans. Buy parts of my face to help. <laughs> Oh, that's pretty clever. Obviously, I think it's all pebbles. Yeah, I don't really need bone blocks anyway. Whoops. Yeah, we've been in there. What's back here? Ooh, oh my gosh, it's a giant shulker. This is cool. This has to be silent, I think. Definitely looks like it'd be up his alley. Oh, I don't want these eyeballs. No, thank you. I'll take the string, though. Why not? <laughs> um, Entrance. Okay, let's check it out. Let's see here. Uh, PS Shulkers have a spiral on the other side, but it's pretty, so no points lost for design. <laughs> okay. Let's check it out. Ooh. What are they selling here? Ooh, I'll definitely buy dry kelp blocks, for sure. Um, could this be Silence? Is he selling bone mill? Uh, I don't know, maybe this isn't Silence. I don't know whose shop this is. Okay. Um, return empty shulkers here. Payment. Uh, well, let's read. Um, welcome to the buy the shulker, the shop where everyone is purchased, where everything is purchased by the shul shulker load. Filled shulkers are organized on the wall, and pricing is the following: uh, box and contents equals one diamond block. Contents minus box is six diamonds. Oh, okay. <laughs> Uh, place the empty shulker in the return barrel if ap applicable. I can't speak today. Words are difficult. Difficult. Um, let's see here. So what could I possibly... Dry kelp seems like a big, like a good choice. Um, and that's uh, a, a box here. Let's see. Let's see. Where is this? So, I think I will purchase a kelp. Um, yeah. One of these. Yeah. I'll definitely purchase one of these. So, let's... Take the top one. I'll keep the box as well. So we'll put the payment in here. And I think I follow the directions correctly, right? I think so. <laughs> I think I did. All right, cool. So we have a shul... Oh, we can't stack those. I forgot. Okay. <clears throat> Yay, we have kelp. And we have an additional box. Shulker box. There we go. Um, let's go ahead and put this right here. I'm going to put that right there. Put that in there. And we are going to eat off of golden carrots. I love golden carrots. Because they are the best source of food. Did we really run out of room? Oh, no, we ran out of room. Okay. Um, what else is here? Carrots. Potatoes. Chicken. Oh, chicken eggs and feathers. Nice. Okay, I wonder what else was here. Oh, look at this. Nice. Okay. So, this is actually a very, very clever little shop. I like it. Oh, wrong way. Let's try this way. <laughs> um, a very clever little shop indeed. I like it. I was probably wrong. I don't know if it is silence. Correct me if I'm wrong. I need to catch up on everybody's videos. I feel like I've been so out of the loop. So out of the loop. But I'm so excited how uh, it's turning out so far. Very neat. Very neat indeed. I know on the other side, there is a little bit more stuff. There is another part of the shopping district that is owned by the, uh, the Diamond Alliance, obviously. And I think there's a couple of shops already over here. Yes, I saw that one earlier. And I was like, what is that? Got some uh, lights. Okay, cool. So I'm, I'm assuming it's all lighting stuff. What did the cake review say? It says, uh, shiny. I agree. Very shiny. <gasps> 64 for two diamonds? Yes, I'm so getting these. Uh, yes, I need this box. Um... 
Let's see here. Ooh, so good. Um, okay, so I think I'll take two stacks. Because, yes. Oh, man, these are going to be great. Oop. Uh, these are going to be great for, like, decorative stuff. Oh, most certainly. I'll put these in here for now. Because I want to say my aqua box is full. Let's see. Yeah, this thing is full. Like, I only had, like, nine. <laughs> nine sea lanterns in there. Okay, cool. Oh, man, this is so exciting. Did I get my box? Did I put everything in there? Okay, cool. Um, <clears throat> man, this is awesome. I love it. I could just keep shopping. I love shopping in real life. And this kind of shopping is fun, too. What's in here? Uh, nothing? Nothing. Um, and then let's head on over here. Oh, this is Zap's. Oh, guys, I didn't show you Zap's map. He made me a map. And it is so nice. Well, not just me, but he made everybody one that looks similar to this. Now, this had to take so much time. Insanely good. I love it. Aha, we got competition here. <laughs> he has four gas tiers for one diamond. I'm selling him for two for a diamond. Ah, he undercut. Oh, magma block. 32 for one diamond. That's actually really good. Oh my gosh, blaze rods. Guys, I will never... Oh, I've been wanting to do something with these blocks right here. One diamond for 32. Hmm. We could possibly do something fun with that. Oh, magma block. 64 for one diamond. Okay. Well, um, I'm no longer selling magma block either. I don't even know if it's worth it. Going back to the nether. Uh, I think the last time I died collecting magma, magma block, which was so horrible because I had like a shulker and a half... Um, that I had collected, and then when I was getting ready to leave, I died. Oh, it's horrible. Anyways, <laughs> nonetheless, um, so I think for the meantime, oh, you know what? I think, I'm pretty sure they're still taking diamonds. They were taking diamonds and pebbles the last time I came over here. <gasps> Bushes! All, all leaves, one, oh my gosh, I have to. Um, spruce, do you have oak? Well, birch leaves are kind of similar to oak. I guess I could take one or two stacks of these. Why not? Oh, I'll just buy all of them. <laughs> Might as well. They're only a diamond. Nice. Okay. Oh, man. I really want oak. I don't know why. Spruce is not that appealing to me. I just never really been a big fan. I don't know if I can fit this in here. Oh, I can't. I can't. Excuse me. Okay. All right. I think we're done shopping in the shopping district. <laughs> we are so done. All right. So let's go ahead and head back over to our place because I want to do a couple of things over there. Not too sure. I think I want to work around the, uh, the town for a little bit. We haven't really done much over there. It's been quite some time and it's been rough because <laughs> I haven't been able to do anything. So I guess a small story time for you guys. So, um, yeah, so I've been, uh, honestly just kind of having like computer i want to say issues because i have a decent computer but it's been um like the very beginning of, of august or of uh, the end of july i ordered a new pc which took you know very little time to get to me but once i got it i was very unsatisfied like the display was really bad so um it was great like the specs were great were great but they used like a really super just not the best display. It wasn't even an ISP display. It was really bad. So I wasn't I wasn't happy. So I sent it back. Then once, you know, of course I had to wait for them to receive it so that I can get my return money. So once I get the return, um, <clears throat> I was able to purchase another laptop. And then I had to wait for that to come. So <laughs> long story short, a little over a month later, here I am trying to <laughs> record. Um, but anyways, oh yeah, so here's my, my, uh, my new newspaper collection wall here. I think I want to make like an official collection wall. I think it'd be pretty awesome. Prowl left a stream. <laughs> um, <clears throat> but I do want to show you guys the map real quick. So this is the map that Prowly, or not Prowl, I saw Prowl's name. Anyway, sorry, I meant uh, Zap, sorry. Uh, Zap made me. And uh, it's amazing. I love it. It looks so good. I love it so much. And I was going to put it on my front door, but I thought in my bedroom would be even better. By the way, guys, if you missed this episode, yeah, we did some decorating. I even decorated this room, which I love how it came out. Love decorating. It's just like the, the best thing ever. Um, anyways, I love it. It looks so good. <laughs> very, very nice. Thanks, Sap, again for that. Very awesome. Um, okay, so now, like I said, we're going to be doing some building today. I do need to get my ender chest. There it is. 
do I have my silk touch? There we go. Let's put our diamonds away. All right, so last episode, we worked on this thing. But I think today, what I want to do, we're not going to build a house or anything because I, I do kind of want to map out first where I'm going to be building my houses because I don't want to just plop houses down. I actually want to map it out and get a good feel for it. Are you trampling my wheat, sir? Both of you must go. Thank you. I'm sorry. I'm so sorry, but you're trampling my stuff. Okay, uh, but anyways, um, let's put those seeds back there we go um but anyways i want to map out and actually plan out where we're going to put everything like our houses and what we're going to actually have and what this house is going to be made for specifically and all that good stuff you know rather than just kind of tossing things wherever uh, i'm going to let some of this stuff go um yeah there we go actually i'll keep that in case um there we go. So I want to actually map out what we're going to be doing and, you know, where we're going to be building stuff. We also need to work on the train because look at this. This is all floating. <laughs> I bet you guys didn't even know that, did you? It's all, you know, slabs so I could put lighting underneath. But, uh, yeah, it's all floating and we need to fix all of this terrain. So that's obviously going to take some time. Um, so, you know, I want to wait on that. But what I want to do is I want to do some interior work. All these houses are done on the outside, but the inside obviously they need work they need a lot of work they need lots of love and then we have this house over here as well um which i just realized doesn't even have a door wait a second does this house really not have a door it doesn't have a door what am i what was i thinking okay it has a door now <laughs> it didn't even have a door <laughs> good grief okay so that one's gonna have like a side door and then we have our little tower here, which is not much to it. Honestly, I don't even feel like this needs to be decorated a whole lot. It's just like a little lookout tower. So I'm just going to leave that alone. But anyways, I think the house we're going to be working on today is this one. We're going to be doing some decorative stuff in here because that's what we do. We do decorative stuff because it's fun and it's awesome. <laughs> okay, so um, let's grab our ender chest. I don't know why I placed it way over here, but we need it closer. But yeah, like I said, I didn't have a whole lot of plans today. Just wanted to do a little stuff around here, you know, make it look all nice and stuff. Um, have some fun. I need to put a door in there, but okay. So I think I'm gonna put this here so it's out of the way. Um, we'll have floating stuff because cool. <laughs> um, let's see here. Let's put that right here. All right, so we don't have much, much slabs there. Okay, that's a good thing I bought logs. Because I think for the floor, let's do, let's do some dark oak. I think dark oak is awesome. So let's do that. It's already looking nice. Already looking good. I kind of want to make a door while I'm at it here because I feel unprotected. There we go. Nice. Here, this will be the roof. I mean, the, the ceiling, the second floor. Yeah, you know what I mean. <laughs> I'm telling you guys, I feel so out of like the loop right now. Out of the loop for everything. <laughs> It's been far too long. And I love, this is like my favorite series ever. Honestly, Truly Bedrock is my favorite series. I don't get to collab as much as I'd like, which at some point I'm sure that will change. But honestly, I love playing with the people that I play with. They're just all amazing. And they're all super like, they're just so inspiring. Like, <clears throat> like I said, I haven't got to watch, um, I keep up with all their videos, but I haven't got to watch a lot of them. Uh, in the last few days actually it's been pretty rough um but <clears throat> I say days but I meant to say like weeks um <laughs> but what I mean like they're just watching their videos like it's really inspiring and just to be able to play with a lot of them they're all so talented they're also just awesome um let's do like that and then now we have new members we have Jesse B I mean come on a fan a little bit girls I'm boys and everybody else and aliens um, <laughs> yeah, we have Jesse V, Kill the Drone, and Echo. So, you know, it's pretty exciting. Some ex exciting stuff. Um, I'm kind of thinking that I want to put an actual staircase in here. There we go. Okay. So, what it's supposed to be like is maybe you can go underneath here and put some storage. Maybe we'll put like a little chest back here. Um, let's see. Let's make one chest. Very nice and then just kind of place it there okay so now that we have that in um, I was thinking like the bedroom we could do right here 
And the way we do that is, let's say we go, um, let's see, let's go like this. Like so, actually we could go like that. All right, so <clears throat> we have a little bedroom here. This is very nice if I do say so myself. And it doesn't take up a lot of room, so it's a lot better than using like full blocks of wood, <laughs> honestly. All right, there you go. You have to walk around here and then here's the bedroom. So cool, very nice. Um, all right, so probably not the best. I kind of wanna have a window there, but that wouldn't really make too much sense. Okay, we won't do that, we won't do that. So we'll leave it just like this. Kind of wanna shorten this a little bit though, honestly. Like, yeah, we'll just leave it like that. Just an actual wall, just kind of there. Like so, okay. So um, then right here, what I wanna do is maybe make like some nice shelving. Like this, just something very not complicated. <laughs> uh, something like that. And then we can put like some shelves here, put a shelf there. Um, let's top off, let's put a chest there and there. So we have a double chest up there. Very nice. So you see what I did there? You just basically put slabs upside down stairs, do all that, and then just kind of top it off with whatever you want. Um, and it just makes something kind of cool, kind of nice. So um, I'm trying to see, do I have, I should have uh, some of those things. What are they called again? Yes, yeah, sea pickles. That's what they're called. <laughs> um, oh, I can't put sea pickles there. But I can put this here instead. Oh, I can't put sea pickles on that either. We'll use a brewing stand. We'll put a bell in here. We'll put some hay bales in here. There's just so many like little things that you can use for decorative. Like, there's so many things. You could just use whatever. And sometimes it doesn't even have to make sense. <laughs> like, but it still looks good, you know? Some people will still look at it and be like, oh, that's that's nice. Anyways, that's my logic on that. <laughs> I just that's how I decorate. Um, do I really not have any lanterns? That's what's crazy, and it's kind of mind-boggling right now. Ooh, scaffolds are great for decorative purposes as well. Um, ooh, it got dark really quick. Let's fix that real quick. Uh, just quickly put some lighting in. Okay, <clears throat> so, uh, let's put in this, because why not? That looks good. Brewing stand. And, uh, hay bales we could put, like, kind of piled up. You know, we could put them back here. Kind of out of the way, you know? Let's say they keep them stocked. There we go. And yeah, that looks good right there. It's perfect. Yeah, there we go. And then maybe one kind of poking out, maybe this direction. Hmm. You know, I kind of like when they're sticking out like that. There we go. All right. So uh, the next thing I want to do is definitely want to add in a carpet. So carpet's kind of a thing that, you know, if you really want to bring out the room, no matter how ugly it could possibly be, because honestly, I think this room's a little, I mean, it's nice. Whoops. Hello. <laughs> um, but could definitely use something. Uh, I do want to put some lanterns in here. Maybe possibly like a picture frame there. That would be nice. Um, I think I have like random stuff. I have a random box. I don't even know what I did with it. Hmm. Hmm. Maybe like not so much here. We could put a full block and another full block carpet uh, there. Yeah. There we go. That looks pretty nice. So let's get rid of these. I'm going to go back to our mansion because I'm pretty sure I'm like almost positive that we do have uh, lanterns already made. I'm not going to make any more. Um, they're probably somewhere silly, somewhere easily found. That house looks so much better. It was just driving me crazy. All of these, especially that one, didn't even have a door on it. <laughs> but there's so many houses here that need to be decorated. Before I even move on, I want to try. And I want to try. I'm not saying going to actually do it. Yeah, I'm gonna try though. Uh, but I like to decorate all of the houses. I want them to actually have interiors because that's gonna be a lot of fun. Come download day. Someday you guys are gonna be able to uh, to test this out this house out for yourselves. I'm looking for lanterns. And uh, it'd be nice to have them all decorated. I kind of feel like we should have a crafting bench in here because at some point I'm gonna wish I had one in here. So there we go. Crafting bench in there done. <laughs> okay so that's all done. So, ladies and gents, I think that's going to be it for today. It was a very chill episode today, and I, and I love chill episodes. I hope you hope you guys enjoyed as well. Um, just some decorating, you know? Just some good old decorating. I think I'm going to do this 
um yeah well we could do this together next episode or i could do it off camera uh but next episode i want to start mapping out this town because we are really going to get to work I, I kind of put it off for a while and uh we're going to really dig into it and get you know get it all done i'm going to have to work out this terrain a little bit but first off i need to figure out and map out what we're going to do and uh I can do like a little bit of explaining and how I want to do that next episode and then we can get to work on at least one building. So, uh, but anyways, yep, that's going to be it for today. I want to thank you guys all so much for the continued support. Um, and I'm just happy to be back on Truly Bedrock. So anyways, as always, I love you all. Uh, excuse my ugly face. Oh, I think I should have my pretty face back next episode. <laughs> oh, so scary. Anyways, I'll see you guys next time. Bye.